How's it going, y'all? Today we're gonna be talking about how to play as Venture, the newest hero in Overwatch 2. She's a damage hero and she carries this huge excavator. Excavation <laughs> this kind of like rock drill. She's insanely good if you know how to play her character. Alright, let's go through all her abilities and toolkit. Let's start with a basic attack called Smart Excavator. Imagine her basic attack is like Farah's basic attack with that splash damage with just really short range as you can see right here. And since her ability is to get up close and personal, her basic attack can be really deadly and able to take heroes down really really quickly. Speaking about abilities, she has two abilities which are Burrow and Drill Dash. Burrow will allow her to move underground and she'll become invulnerable and immune to all damage. This ability has an 8 second cooldown. You can also control when to emerge and every time she pops out from the ground if there's any player, those players will take damage. Her next ability is called Drill Dash. She will dash forward and push enemies back. It has an 8 second cooldown. However, if you use it during Burrow, the cooldown will be reduced to just 4 seconds. You can use Burrow and then Drill Dash back to back to get out of spawn and out of combat really really quickly. Also to maximize travel distance, you can use Drill Dash just right at the end of your Burrow ability. Just like how you cancel Mauga's Tom, just to get that a little bit of extra distance. And finally, if you combine her Burrow and Drill Dash, you can actually knock players back. It will take a little bit of practice, you need to do this in the practice range. If you just perform a drill dash while burrowing, you will most probably fall down with the enemies as well. All you want to do is just to practice the distance as well as to hold the back key or move backwards as soon as you hit your target. This will prevent your character from falling down the pit. As I said earlier, you need to practice this a couple of times until you finally get used to it. Alright, next let's talk about her passive. Venture has three passive abilities. The first one is really cool, damaging an enemy, temporarily reduces your healing receive. It's not like Anna where you permanently block healing, although I think she's gonna be a really good combo with Anna. It's just a small healing debuff, you can hit multiple targets and put some extra pressure on the enemy healers. Her next passive is called Clover. Her quick melee will deal more damage than other heroes quick melee. That's a slightly longer animation. If you get the chance to get close to enemies, which you will usually do most of the time, be sure to throw in that quick melee. Because you have to remember her basic attack only has like 8 ammo, which is very limited. Alright, her final passive is the Explorer's Resolve. Using abilities grants temporary shield. If you use the Burrow ability, you'll gain 40 shield. And if you use the Drill Dash ability, you'll gain 35 shield points and you can have 325 total health and armor at one point. She's pretty tanky, she has good survivability with her movements and abilities. And if played correctly, you can't even see her most of the time because she'll be underground. And finally we have her ultimate, which is a really cool looking ultimate called Tectonic Shock. After using her ultimate, you'll see 4 charges in the middle of your screen, which means you can only use it 4 times. It'll do a huge cone damage right in front of you, which will knock enemy players. It has a decent distance, as you can see here, and the damage is really massive. That's it for today's video. Hope this guide is useful. If you did, be sure to hit that like and also subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, peace out.